My six-year-old just told me I look like the brown little mermaid. She was standing at my door right now and I asked her to close my door because my son is gaming. And she's like, mommy, she's like, mommy, you look like Ariel, the new Ariel that's brown like me. And that made my heart melt so much. So today we're going 100% glueless. This one is a glueless closure lace wig. Not only does the lace come pre-cut, not only does the lace come glueless, but it also came already styled with these baby hairs. Now I gave you guys a sneak peek of this wig on TikTok, but she really came out to be a stunner. Literally out the box, these baby hairs are already swooped. I was able to put her on and you guys know I did a little style and finesse. We're going to do a little dynamic duo here. We're going to add a new mousse here and then we're going to go ahead and diffuse and that is pretty much how I got this look. I love the height, the volume, the body on this one. She's definitely giving brown girl magic, black girl magic. She is definitely on theme with the Little Mermaid and I'm so happy that my daughter was able to identify that with the color. Obviously the texture is a little bit different but Y'all know what she was talking about. Y'all get the drip. I'm going to go ahead and jump into the tutorial. Be sure to check this one out in the description box. Also, check out The Little Mermaid if you haven't already. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into the install. Tomorrow we are going for a red look. And tonight we are preparing. It's like a red auburn burgundy. This color gives like chic anyways this is the wig here and it comes from Eunice but you guys can see the eye opener the start of the sh show the game changer about this one is that it is a ready to go wig as you guys can see the lace is already pre-cut now I didn't go and prep this wig on the mannequin head to come to you guys this one literally came like this straight out of the box so if you look at it really closely the lace is already cut which yeah we've seen that a couple times before we've been seeing that lately but it also has the baby hair already pre-styled so if you're someone who says like I don't know how to do baby hair they did it for you so I'm gonna go ahead literally and plop her on and go the only prep work I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and tint the lace you guys know I use like a nice warm chocolatey chocolate like me color and I just buff it in I'm more so focused on the hairline and then this is a look at the inside construction of the cap we're going closure today and it's a really nice breathable cap this is the detachable elastic band also that it comes with and then also this is what the back of the wig looks like so I don't have to go ahead and adjust any straps this is going to just do the work and just grip on so let's go ahead and switch out the wigs wow first of all first impression is that i'm absolutely impressed haven't done anything to it if you are someone who just literally needed to put a wig on and go you can literally put it on and go now you guys i'm gonna finesse and make it look like how i like it to look i'm gonna go ahead and just use my fingers to finger to tangle and as you guys can see none of the hair is catching it's not tangled um no crazy shedding my hands are not getting locked up you have a couple pieces but my hands are not getting like locked up and loaded with hair now we're gonna go ahead and use the wax stick this one comes from my brand bdeckbeauty.com new packaging new everything coming soon and i'm just gonna go generous because this is a curly wig if this was a short wig or a straight wig i would go a little bit lighter handed just because i feel like you know you don't want your wig to look oily but with you know nice full dense curly hair you really don't have that problem okay let's go ahead and do like 110 heat passes of this to get it really flat in here so extra but i know i'm the same hey google turn off thermostat all right changing the bedroom to off. i went ahead and did the dynamic duo you guys can see the progression or the difference um it was a lot more full here which i would say a lot of people prefer i am going to go ahead and let it get wet because i do want it to be wavy and i want it to be not just like flat and curly i want it to all transcend it'll come together you'll see how it'll come together really nicely but i do want to mention this one is glueless i think we already knew that but i don't want there to be any smoke and mirrors it already came with the baby hair and it already came with everything it needed so what i'm going to do to turn it up a notch for moi is i'm going to go ahead and tint the lace and i'm going to use two different products and this is a double-sided foundation palette um it's cream foundation so it's a little bit thicker a little bit closer to like a concealer consistency pack it in on one side pack it in on the other side and then I take and I just go in generously and I go more so on the lace and just pat it in and then to make it match I kind of will hold this the 
brush like sideways like standing up and I kind of like brush it into the hairs and then I'm gonna do the mousse trick which mousse is a great way um, to make your lace look melted this is from lot of body you guys can see how the lace you can see it I'm just gonna add a decent amount and mousse does not bond a wig down not even a little bit but it does again give that melted effect and I'm not gonna put it directly because I do have makeup on and I don't want to go too crazy and mess my makeup up let's go in and allow the lace to melt down so just because it's glueless it doesn't have to look like it's sitting on top of your head you want it to look melted since we already have this mousse out and this is a oop, brand new bottle from Amazon I'm just gonna do my whole little mousse trick and I'm just gonna go ahead and generously add this I will give my hair a little bit of a wet down and then we'll go mousse and then dim and brush and we might diffuse love me in spite of my trauma give me what I need instead of the drama when it pop off, it's like, oh my, all good all day, but the night we be going so hard on the flip side. So tell me we'll be on a day, babe. I could keep that same energy. When you go low, I go low too. But you'd rather stay high, I know you. Can we stay high, babe? I'd rather be on that way. Trying to control our okay so i went ahead and curled up the hair with a lot of body mousse and i think it did an amazing job i'm gonna go ahead and i'm just gonna diffuse it a little bit Oceans, if we on a rise out of passion we could share love in the ocean but if you wanna go insane either way baby we could go all night we could do it all night now one thing about diffusing when you use mousse um you do get a little bit of crunch especially at the ends and if you know me you know i like a little bit of crunch I don't know if you guys can hear but you guys can see the definition is still there but because it's uh more dry i would say it's probably about maybe 70 percent dry um it definitely shrinks up so i do love it both ways so i'm gonna do this side off camera and then we will take the melt belt off and get the final results okay and then this is the look and you guys can see how it shrunk i can kind of pull it apart which i'll do in just a moment but you guys get the point in the picture and again you can pull it out to make it bigger also the more you mess with it it'll get like more frizzy if you want more of a natural look we were melting the hairline down wow you guys see what a huge difference that is okay really quickly i'm about to head out and take my pictures but i wanted to show you guys what i was talking about about it being glueless you guys can see i've already lifted it a little bit for my intro but you can't really see the lace right and then you put your Right, so a comb in there and it's like magic. It really is not glued down, it's not sticky, anything like that. It is 100% glueless. It's just sitting there, but it fits like an absolute glove. Now let's go ahead and get to the outro of the video. This one is bomb. And my daughter just told me I look like a little brown mermaid. I love it here. Before I go, I'll share the packaging with you guys. We already know this one came from Eunice and this is their um, standard packaging. When you open it up, you do have your goodies inside. Uh-oh. And then also, when you come inside, there's nice, a good amount of goodies, right? So inside, you do have a pack of the HD wig caps. So you do also get your dust bag that you're supposed to keep forever. I'm not sure what these are. Let's find out. I love when I get like new goodies because we already know the usual suspects. So you flip it out. I think this is a crochet needle. Oh my God, how cute is that? It looks like it's a crochet needle. I'm gonna say that's what this is. I'm not 100% sure, but it's definitely travel size. So you lift it up like that, push it back down and travel size. This is cute. I'm definitely gonna hold on to this. And this here, oh, this is really nice. They have a nice mirror. I don't wanna blind you guys, but it does have the Eunice um, engraved right there there in the middle this is that little mesh bag that you know comes with all of my packages from Eunice and inside you do get another pack of HD wig caps and then from there you also get the Eunice logo melt belt and then you get a pack of really nice 3d mink lashes and last but certainly not least you get your really nice kabuki brush and this one is gold typically I get rose gold this one is gold, so I'm going to put this one in my makeup bag right now because I like the gold one. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and let you guys go. I'm really loving, loving, loving the steps I did with this one. I think she looks so good. She looks so natural, and the lace 
this closure lace looks absolutely stunning it looks so natural now if you're not a baby hair girl you can definitely thin the baby hair out you can cut it shorter or you can just take your baby hair brush and like just start combing all of it back and then like when you add your mousse you'll be able to work the baby hair back into the hair without like cutting it out um and that's a way to kind of like change it up if you don't want the baby hair permanently or temporarily or whatever the case may be thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment subscribe share with your friends and as always i'll see you in the next one smooches